we just pulled into the USA RV park in Gallup, New Mexico. And you guys, it's not quite light out yet, but we just had to come do the tour right now because it's snowing. Look at the camper, you guys. It, the camper has never been in this heavy of snow. It literally like barely snowed in Iowa, but it is starting to stick. So let's walk around the campground. Okie dokie, so we just walked past a couple of the RV sites and then up here, this is the main office. Right across from the main office, they do have some cabin sites. And up here, if you go down this road, you would exit. But if you turned a little, there are even more RV sites over there. <clears throat> the landscaping here is absolutely impeccable. Let me just show you guys how pretty and pristine. Now everything's getting covered in snow, but the landscaping here, I mean, no weeds, all of the plants look great. We really, really like the look of this place. Look at how pretty it looks with all the snow coming down. And then this is the entrance you get. And they do have some propane right over here. And the speed limit, I just think it's really, really funny. The speed limit is 12 miles per hour. I want to know how they came up with 12. I mean, why not 10? Why not 15? I think that is really, really funny. And we actually lost our map to this place, but we're just gonna walk around and show you guys what we see. The bathrooms look really nice, nice showers, no tokens needed, and there's no code on the door and the bathrooms are open all the time. We'll be using those later. Here's the dump station. Just um, remember that the water is not potable. And they've got really big trash receptacles around the entire park. Then they have this covered area. I'm not sure what they do down in there, but there looks to be a little like open building at the end. They've got a little playground right there. A little fenced in area behind that. It looks to be a pool. Obviously you can't use it now. It's covered in snow. Then they've got a fountain right here. It's turned off for right now. But yeah, there is the camper. I think Xena has had enough snow. I'm going to drop her off and then I'm going to go try out the shower. Okie dokie. Now that I am completely covered in snow, I'm going to take a shower and I'll tell you guys how it was. Okie dokie. Right off the bat, this was super confusing. So you turn it on. And it like has resistance down here, like it doesn't want to keep going. So I left it right here, expecting that to get hot. Well, it never did. To get hot water, you have to go all the way up and around. But yeah, really nice, super hot water, great water pressure, clean shower. I like the little shelf. And the best part is that there is no time limit. They've got a laundry machine room, nice sink. There's the prices for that. Let's keep going. And checkout is at noon. <clears throat> There's no pets allowed in the store. I just um, went in there and all the lights are turned off. So I don't think they're open yet. And then in here is the pool. And then you can see the playground from kind of a different angle. Now I'm gonna go under that little covered thing. Okay, this place is pretty close to the pool. Just a little bit of a walk. And it looks like they've got a barbecue restaurant. Does not appear to be open. And then inside of this open end, it's like a um, arc display of the Marines and the army. That's really cool. And then this whole thing is covered. It's not like totally waterproof. As you can see, the tables are wet with snow. But let's go read this sign on this little pig. Because if this place, I don't know if this place is open. Oh, that just kind of tells the menu. Inside, it looks like it's probably closed. Okie dokie, so then if you go into the front of the building, you walk into like a gift shop, uh, convenience store type situation. They've got all sorts of camping essentials, a bunch of, ooh, they even have dog stuff, drinks, ice cream, anything you can possibly think of. Cool different rocks that are carved. 
sweatshirts, magnets, clocks, signs, blankets. Okie dokie, so it stopped snowing. I did end up getting a really cool ornament from the gift shop. There's kind of the back of the gift shop. I'm not sure what's up there. And I think, you guys, that I've looked at everything. Somewhere I said there's supposed to be like a dog run. But like I said, I lost my map. So maybe I'm just going to have to walk back there and try to locate it somewhere. Because I don't know. It's nowhere up where I have walked around so far. And they also have another laundry room kind of in the middle of the park. But it is closed for the season. And me and Zena finally found the doggy area. And we are almost there. Okie dokie. So it's just like in the corner of the campground. The dogs are cute. And yeah. Go potty. Go potty, Zena. Go potty. Go potty, Zena. And this park is actually a pretty nice size, you guys. It did start to snow again. And they do have some poop bags over there. If you didn't bring your own. Are you done? You don't have to go potty? Okay, come on. Come on. Let's go back. Okie dokie, you guys. I think we have looked at everything. And we forgot to mention, this place has tent sites. They have RV sites that just have water and electric. And they also have full cook-up RV sites. And I did mention the cabins. I couldn't find anywhere like a sign that had the rates. So you'll have to check the website for those. But this is kind of what the little setup looks like at our campground. So yeah, definitely come check them out. So yeah. We will definitely be staying at this place again. Oh, there is one more thing. So on the opposite side of the campground than the cabins I showed you, there are these, they almost look like mobile homes all the way over there. I'm not sure if that's actually part of the park or not, but I did see people going in and out of them. But yeah, we really like this park. I mean, I'm gonna say that we love this park. Really, really nice. Zena is totally freezing, but she had a great time. She has not been like walking around in snow for a super long time. Definitely come check this place out. There was one thing I couldn't find on their website. It says they have a game room. I couldn't figure out where that was. But if you liked this video, make sure to give us a big thumbs up, comment down below and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to hit that bell so that you never miss the next time this little cutie tries out a new park, tries out a new food, tries a new restaurant or posts any one of our random videos. Get out and enjoy what God has given us and get out and enjoy nature and food as much as we do. Have a great one. Um, bye.